Hello students and welcome to the next lesson in our AS Level Physical Geography course. Today we're going to learn about outwash planes. How does an outwash plane form? An outwash plane is the flat expanse of sediment deposited in front of a glacier. The meltwater carries sediment away from the snout of the glacier as the meltwater begins to retreat. As the stream carries the sediment, the sediment gets deposited when the stream loses energy. The sediment then gets deposited into sections and is sorted. Gravel is deposited first because as the, as the river in the meltwater channel loses energy, it is not going to be carol being able to carry the heavier gravel particles. So as a result, they are deposited first. Clay particles are smaller than gravel, so they get deposited last. It leaves behind the stratified sections of deposited sediment. So this is what it may look like. Firstly, we have the glacier, which is now um, leaving out a proglacial uh, channel. Then it's going to deposit all the heavier particles first as it loses energy, followed by the smaller ones. We then get these stratified sections, which forms the outwash plane. So the larger ones indicate gravel, and the smaller particles indicate clay and sand. Here are some questions on the formation of outwash planes. Answer these on another sheet of paper by pausing the video to give yourself time. Hit play whenever you're ready to see the answers. Here are the answers. If you got these right, congratulations, and I advise you to move on to the next video, which will be on eskers and canes. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.